In this video, I'm going to show you some tips and tricks inside of IntelliJ and specifically around auto imports. You may have saw in the last video there in the code review that I had some auto imports happening. This is actually a feature I just recently started using. So let me demonstrate the default behavior. So I'm going to copy this configuration here and let me create a new class. I'm just going to call this temp. Now I'm, I'm not going to be putting this into uh, GitHub for the course. So that's why I'm, I'm going to actually delete it when I'm done. So the default behavior of IntelliJ is when I come in and paste this in, I'm going to get a pop-up asking me about the classes to import. So this only takes a second to do, but I mean, if you're worked with IntelliJ, I always, uh, you just kind of click through it. So that is uh, one way uh, to handle this. Now I'm going to just hit uh, control Z to undo. Now, if I come up here to preferences and under editor auto import, now I can say all, and then also this add these uh, unambiguous imports on the fly. So I'm also going to do that and apply that and say, okay. And now watch what happens when I do the paste action. You can see that things were came in, pasted. You can see that they're momentarily red because they were unresolved. And then IntelliJ went ahead and added in the import statement. So those import statements on line three to six, that was automatically added by IntelliJ for us. And one other feature I am going to try, I actually have not tried this yet. So if I come back to preferences, uh, I'm going to go ahead and optimize these imports like so. Let's, let's try that. So now if we have this and I'm thinking if I comment out the bean. So now you can see I comment out the bean annotation and IntelliJ automatically remove that import. So that's kind of a pet peeve of mine is having uh, unused imports. So I try to keep my code clean. If you don't need the import, you should get rid of it. So now if we return that, you can see that IntelliJ automatically added in that import for us. So real nice feature of IntelliJ. I just recently started using it myself. So IntelliJ does have a ton of features. And I, I mean, I've been using IntelliJ for like 15 years and uh, uh, almost every day. And I, I still learn stuff. So hopefully you found this little, little tips and tricks helpful because I am going to be continuing to run with these settings like this on IntelliJ because it does save you a little bit of time. And just to reiterate in these uh, settings, if you come up here to uh, preferences and specifically under editor, general, import. So the settings I changed is I changed this from ask to all. And then also I added in, selected the checkbox for add unambiguous imports on the fly. And then also check the box for optimize imports on the fly. So as you develop your code and need imports, IntelliJ will automatically when I configure them out, it automatically will go ahead and add them for you.